Hello everybody, it's your immigration attorney, Luis Ruiz, here with you today to talk to you about the Visa Bulletin. What is the Visa Bulletin? The Visa Bulletin is a monthly publication by the U.S. government that tells you which visas are available now and it helps you to keep up to date with when you qualify to, uh, to apply for a green card to come into the United States legally. So the Visa Bulletin is based on priority date. The priority date is going to be found on your I-130 receipt, uh, receipt notice, which tells you when your application was filed, uh, and it'll come when you get an approval notice, and on there it'll say priority date. So once you know your priority date, you go to the Visa Bulletin, and it's going to come up on our screen here in a bit, um, and you're going to find out what category you're, you're, you're in, um, and that'll determine what date they're processing and when the visa becomes available. So who does not need to wait on a visa to become available? Who is Who already qualifies immediately? So that category of people are called immediate relatives. Immediate relatives are spouses, children, and parents of US citizens. Those people already have a visa available. All they have to do is apply and to, to receive it, okay? Now you have to qualify. You have to qualify independently to be able to obtain a green card. But what immediate relative category does is that you don't have to wait. Like you'll see in a minute, everybody else has to wait. So who does have to wait? So there's five different categories. The first one is going to be category F1. F1 is for sons and daughters over 21 years of age of U.S. citizens. Those people. Sons and daughters of U.S. citizens always have to wait until their visa becomes available in order for them to obtain lawful status to come into the United States. The second category is F2A. The F2A category is for spouses and children, which is 21 and under, of permanent residents. F2B is for unmarried sons and daughters of permanent residents. Sons and daughters means 21 years of age or older. Category F3 is for married sons and daughters, 21 years of age or older, of United States citizens. And the last category is the F4 category and it's for siblings. So depending on your relationship with your petitioner, it's gonna dictate which category you fall under. So if you are 23 year old and your permanent resident father petition you, then you are gonna be uh, category F2B, unmarried, son and daughter, 21 years of age or older, of a permanent resident. So how do you determine when your visa is gonna be available? Well, you look at your priority date and then you go to the Visa Bulletin, which should be popping up here, and you go under category F2B. When you get to F2B, depending on your country, if you're from Mexico, for example, you'll cross over until you get to Mexico, and you're gonna see that F2Bs from Mexico are currently, the, the visas are available for people who filed before July 22nd, 1997. So if your priority date is uh, October 1st, 1998, your visa is not yet available. You have to wait until it becomes current, until the bulletin says uh, that that date has passed or, or it's exactly on that date, okay? So until that date comes you do, uh, on the bulletin, you are not eligible to obtain permanent residence through that petition that was filed on your behalf um, until the, the, the date becomes available. So you know, you'll have to know the relationship between the person who filed for you. You have to qualify under one of these categories. Either immediate relative means no waiting, available immediately, or F1, F2A, F2B, F3, or F4. Once you know which category you're in, you have your priority date, you do, you do the, uh, the chart, uh, you see and analyze when your date is available, that's when you'll know uh, when you qualify to file for a green card. If you think you qualify now, or if you need some help reading the Visa Bulletin, give our office a call. We're here to help you. Our number is 832. 390-4664. Give us a call. We are fight for your rights. We'll make sure that you are able to, if you qualify, that you are able to stay in the United States or to enter the United States lawfully uh, as a permanent resident. You can find us online. Our website is LuisReeseLaw.com or on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Our handle is at LuisReeseLaw. We're here to help. Give us a call.